$11,000. She was... Outrage. <laughs> Anger. <laughs> and disappointment. As the residents of Seattle gather to protest the death of Indian student John V. Kandula. We scraps at us, we took the scraps and went home. It will not happen that way. But it's a start. It's been months since Kandula was accidentally mowed down by Seattle cop Daniel Odoro. Then when he hit the brakes, flew off the But the viral video of the policeman's body cam footage has ignited the fury and resentment of the members of the South Asian community who demand accountability. Yeah, <laughs> what? Well, Eleven thousand dollars. She was twenty-six anyway. She had limited value. Our <laughs> daughter's That's right. Hey, no, no. get it off your mind. Yes. Okay. But we don't want to be another movement where we scream and yell and destroy things and then nothing happens. The vice president of the police union. If you don't know what the police union is, it's the people that are supposed to hold bad caps accountable. And he's the vice president. So if he's the vice president of the union that's supposed to hold he cops saves. accountable, that's why nothing happens to bad cops. Leaders representing the South Asian community met with Seattle's mayor Bruce Harrell in a closed door meeting to discuss the steps forward with both the mayor and the chief of the police department expressing their condolences. On behalf of the city of Seattle, uh, we want to express our uh, extreme condolences for your loss and making sure that our apologies as city official are felt to your community and your family. So my, uh, my condolences for your loss. I know that I've talked to the brother and, and some of the other family, but we're here to continue to listen because we're here, we want to stand with you, we want to figure out ways that you also heal from the situation. We also want to figure out also that we had these insensitive comments and we want to work to ensure that that never, ever occurs, that we value our human life, that we do not dehumanize others. But until now, there is no assurance on the legal action that is yet to be taken against the police officer who laughed off Kandula's death. The police officer's guild has brushed off any racial angle maintaining that Odoro did not know who the victim was and that his remarks were taken out of context, which has angered protesters further, all of whom want accountability. I think people do feel jaded about seeing officers held accountable within the department. Um, I hope that changes, you know, and, and the city is watching and we are expecting there to be changes and to be accountability. <laughs> And the incident has shaken the faith of other Indian students, any of whom could have suffered Janvi's fate. I came just like her on student visa, that young, and I walked to work. It could have been me. The tragic incident has garnered criticism from within the US as well as the international community, with all eyes on what the Seattle administration will do next. Nayantara Singh for NDTV.